Hey guys, Tux here, and I have another unboxing today for you. Today's unboxing is going to be a Western Digital hard drive. And what prompted me to get this is that my computers run off of SSD. And for you guys who have gaming rigs, you know that SSD is the very best. It's what makes computers boot quickly. It's like what you really want in your computer. The problem, of course, is that SSD hard drives are more expensive. Um, they're, they're pricey. The prices have come down quite a bit. But um, right now, the problem is they're rather expensive compared to regular hard drives, and the size of the hard drive itself is much smaller. And that has gotten better, even in the last few months. But right now, um, they're under a terabyte. You know, they're like, you know, like 250 or 120 gigabytes, which is more than enough for like an operating system and one or two games, but not enough for everything. You know, photos, music you know video if you do video editing you really need a lot of space so um, my main rigs well my main rig has more than one hard drive it has SSD for booting and for a little bit of game stuff and it has another hard drive for video and applications multimedia etc etc okay um, my secondary computer only had the SSD which is fine but it wasn't really enough to do saving things so that's where this comes in it's a new hard drive so let's open this up and take a look, and I don't know what to expect. I purchased this off Amazon on special over the holiday weekend, um, or the Christmas holiday, and we will see what's in the box. I'm not sure if it's OEM or not. We'll find out together. I'm carefully trying not to uh, move the tripod here, so if this bounces or moves a little, I apologize in advance. Let's see here. All right, in the Amazon box, first off bubbles, good sign. Next we have a little box in the box, and that makes this look like OEM to me, which is fine. Um, for those of you who don't know, um, sometimes when you buy things off Newegg or Amazon, you get OEM, which are original manufacturer computer parts which are cheaper to sell because they don't have all the fancy commercial retail store graphics and pictures and things on the box. It's just the part essentially. It's what Dell has in the warehouse, etc. for building thousands of computers for thousands of people. So I like OEM. I have no problem with it. Um, and this is basically what you get is a blank box with a barcode on it. So let's open this up a little further. And on the inside is pretty much what you'd expect. And that is a hard drive in a anti-static case with some plastic on it. And that is the Western Digital 3 terabyte hard drive. And you can see it has all the standard stuff on it. Um, the front side, of course, metal. This is not really meant as an external drive, so there is some electronics showing. So you want to be careful not to touch those. Um, some people have lots of theories and best practices when it comes to touching hard drives. Um, a lot of people say you should not touch them. You know, you should have an anti-static um, ground on yourself, like touching the ground or a belt or something, and all these weird rules. Personally, I don't really subscribe to that theory. I've never had a problem, so I touch them. And we'll take this out just to look at it. Okay, so inside here... We have the hard drive itself. This one here you can see is three terabytes, which is pretty huge. And these just came down in price um, to under $100, um, about 80 bucks, which is the all-time record low. It was probably a Christmas special. Um, these usually go for a little bit more, but now is a really good time to buy them, or at least when I bought this on sale, it was a really good time. And with Prime, of course, that shipped second day for free. It has all the standard plugs you'd expect. And these can be plugged into an external cartridge unit like I do have a couple of those on a few of my computers for torrents and such and um, that's pretty much it it's SATA 64 megabyte um, cache and this is the Western Digital WD30 Easy RX and piece of cake to install, uh, install um, but it does not come with a cable unfortunately so you'll have to have supply your own cable which probably came with the motherboard okay Anyway, I hope that helps. If you guys have any questions about installing hard drives, I've installed tons of these. Um, they usually do not come formatted. Um, if it's not OEM, it usually contains software, because oftentimes you can't even install it straight up. You have to format it first. 
Um, so if you have problems installing your hard drive, feel free to ask in the questions down below. And if you like this video, be sure and subscribe. Okay? Thanks for watching, guys. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.